The crisis on UC Davis's campus five years ago may have seemed like the worst challenge that Chancellor Linda Katehi would face in her time there. After campus police pepper sprayed peaceful student protesters and the incident was captured on video that went worldwide, Katehi weathered a storm of calls for her to step down. Now, the Chancellor faces what even her own aides say may be a bigger challenge, one that has resulted in her suspension while she has investigated over a series of missteps and allegations that she lied about her involvement in hiring firms to scrub negative references about her and the campus from the Internet. Newly released documents from UC Davis illustrate how deeply this scandal hurt inside the Merak Hall offices where Katehi oversaw the campus. The records, released to the B through the California Public Records Act, are the latest batch of documents the university has provided that give a glimpse into how the campus spent $175,000 to improve its online reputation, then plunged into a defensive crouch over news stories about the move. Talking points, question and answer sheets, and pre-dawn emails show the toll the controversy and an attendant five-week occupation of Merak by students took on campus officials. Today, Katehi is still waiting to see whether she will get to return to her job, and the controversy has moved the pepper spray incident they tried to contain back to the top of internet search engines.